Welcome back to Let's Play Greedfall Blind. I'm your host, Lasan Fay. So, um, the only thing I did between last episode and this episode was sleep and um, work and eat and all the usual have a life things um, and fast travel to the camp because um, I figured you guys didn't need to see the loading screen. So. Now, we're going to go off this way and we'll do some more camp hunting. All right. So, round the corner. I guess I forgot to, or I didn't loot them to begin with. All right. So now I want to hug the left wall. in, didn't you? Ooh, that's why I missed this earlier. It was madness. You know, I just, I haven't done a whole lot of, like, basic exploring. Oh. to get dicey. Secret didn't need you to swing a weapon at all that time. All right. So, let's go up here. So I've got a nice little windy trail before I'm going to get somewhere. Yep. And we curve to the right after getting some ore. And then back to the left. even bothering collecting the ore because I like do no crafting ever. <gasps> Yay! Camp area. Alright, sweet. That's definitely one of those things that I know I will like. So what's over here? see. Okay, I know that's the actual path. Well, there's something there. Interesting lighting. The 
Okay, that was... I was supposed to not go this way. Well, wasn't this where I saw the tent thing? here. I was here. There is probably a quest related to this and I have found this too early. Yeah, especially with the blood and the chains and the terrible stuff. Okay, this, these were the actual tents that I saw. Okay, so I could have turned there for that. So... Around here? Is... A very steep cliff to climb at some point. No need to right now. And another ritual site. Kind of like the root path. Okay. Alright, feeling better. feeling like I've more successfully explored this place. Now, let's see if I can get out. Hey! I did that fairly successfully. I'm rather proud of myself. there. So is this? I'd rather talk to Dunkus. I'll just flat out admit that. Okay. Yeah, not, I don't I think I'm okay on my inventory. Yeah, I'm fine. I'm like, gotten more strength and bigger. Okay. Um. Ah, I chose the wrong one. Bugger. The Gigador. Ulan was just kind of a pain. Us help. What brings you here on Omanawi? Well, I seek Vinbar, your High King. I was told you were among the last to have seen him. I do not know if that is true. Others most certainly cross this path after me. But since you have helped our island. It is only right that I help you in return. The last time I saw him, we were in Dorhad Genedu. 
He wanted us to help him decide what we should do about you. You, the Renaixe. Dedra and Bladnid wanted us to spill blood and chase you from our lands. Ulan's words were all honey, as is his talent, and wanted us to welcome you with open arms. I attempted, as is my want, to follow the part of wisdom, that which winds between the others. Vinbar was not convinced by any of us. He decided to turn to a far greater source of wisdom. Uh -huh. He left us to go to the sanctuary to see Anonymil Frichtimen. Would he still be there? I do not think so. The Great Mind must have guided his footsteps in a direction beyond our understanding. But he would not have abandoned his people without first seeing his own one last time. Um. You should go to Wenshavar. Maybe there they would know where you could find him. Thank you, Dunkas. Thank you. Wenshavar. Lovely. I'm so close to a level, I almost, like, want to get into a fight now. Uh, Winshavar. Hey, Isn't it nice that I was just here and picked up camps? I actually didn't know that would happen. Obviously, because I don't think I found the village. But I guess it is around here. Yep, it is around here. Okay, please don't kill me. All right, I've reached my destination. Hello. Nice. Oh. Fuck. I want Siora. Should have grabbed her. Like, I should have thought about it and grabbed her. Um. Got other companions. Composed team. Confirm. Let's go. Winshavar. Well, you have the talky, floaty head thing. But here, Tumad, it is rare to see Renaixe here. Is there something I can do for you? Uh. I'm looking for High King Vinbar. I know that he disappeared after having visited the heart of the island, but someone here in his village might know where he went after that. If anyone knows, it would be Sarah. But you will not find her here. Anything uh, else? Uh. Would you know where I could find Sarah? She left to follow Vimbor. She wanted the mountains to take her as well. What do you mean? I don't know if Renaixe could understand. I... Our High King is on Olmenawi, and a Donegad. His bond with the mountain is very strong. Even stronger now that he speaks with the En Olmil Frichtimen. Sera knew that the mountain would take him back, and she wanted the mountain to take her as well. 
She went to attempt to bond herself to it. She sought the cavern of knowledge. Okay. We haven't seen her since. She might have succeeded. Anything else? Uh... Where is this cavern of knowledge located? And is it different we than the one I saw with The caverns of knowledge are the concern of the Donegada. Caverns. Anything else? Okay, uh... No. Thank you for your help. Gwa Aulamsek. Bird tear to mud. Why are you wearing the same clothes as a Renaixe? Uh. There's another one. Okay. This way? Oops, sorry. Beard Tilto Mud on Almanawi. Esquetu. Hello. I'm sorry, but I do not speak your language. Really? Then you are a Renaigse. I have never met one with the bond. Well. Might I do something for you? Uh. I heard talk about a cavern of knowledge. It is a place where the Donigada go, within the earth. They hear the voices of those that went before them, and they learn. There are some on Tiafradi. The closest to our village is found to the northeast of here. But oh, the entrance is sealed, hidden. It is a sacred place. A place for only the Donegada. Anything else? Uh, no. Goodbye. What hour am Okay. That is up here. Yes. Okay. Sweet. Hey, my curiosity in going camp hunting paid off. Um, travel there. Yes. What stops your tongue? You think someone's coming to save you? Give in. Your life is in our hands. It is time to tell us all you know. The sooner you speak, the sooner this will be over with. We're not alone. We better be discreet if we want to keep the element of surprise. Yeah, so I was right. She's been enduring this punishment for hours, blow upon blow through gritted teeth. Truly savage beast we have here. Do we even know if it speaks our language? Leave us. You will eventually tell us how you found your way into that grotto. Your defiance is only prolonging the inevitable. You remind me of that rat my master was studying. The creature used all of its fire in an effort to escape. Yeah, well. Scratching, twisting, refusing to understand that the cage holding it was its only remaining world. It had everything it could ever need, but it wouldn't stop looking for a way out. His freedom's important. Even though its fate was now sealed, 
to serve science. Its animal instinct drove it to flee. It had strangled itself between the bars of its own cage in a final futile attempt to escape. It was an enormous beast and very clever. If it had simply relented, it could have lived peacefully for many years. Instead of that... <laughs> These monsters are torturing her. Come, we must set her free. Oh my if God. we act now, we'll certainly have to fight them. But if we wait until nightfall, we should be able to set her free discreetly. It's your decision. What time is it? Surely she'll make it. Wait a minute. I don't think I'm carrying it. Oh, I am. Sweet. Siora, please don't be angry at me for trying to be discreet. Okay. He stops there. When does he move? I did ask for combat.
how are you feeling? Better now. Those Renaikse are absolute monsters. I agree. But who not. are you? You too are a Renaikse. Why have you freed me? We were told at Wenshavar that you and you alone could tell us where to find High King Vinbar. I wish I knew where he was right now. He bid me farewell weeks ago and he has not returned. I waited a long time Can and we not then talk I came here? here to enter into the Cavern of Knowledge. You believe that this is where he is hiding? No. But he came here often before he disappeared. I'm hoping to find answers. You save me. And so I must help you as well. You may come with me. Let's try to escape without bloodshed. We must get you to a safe place. All right, this way. Since I've already cleared it out. You know, unless they put more. Which it doesn't look like they did. I'll take it all. All right. Sweet. So now we head towards the cavern. Considering I only had to kill two people, that wasn't too bad. Yep. Alright. I've seen the cavern. Already once. But thank you. It is really, really appreciated. That we can both use the same seed. Because I would hate to have to find another one. Here is the entrance to the Cavern of Knowledge. I hope that Vinbar has left a clue to where he went. Something I could track. Same. Is it your wish to join him? He is my Manundanem. That means the one who shares my mind in your language. We must be reunited. I understand. But why protect the entrance to the cavern at the risk of your own life? The caverns of knowledge are truly sacred places. Only the Donegada have the right to enter. But you are not a Donegad. Is that right? I am not, but I must enter in spite of everything. And since you have helped me, you may enter as well. It's okay, I've got Even if with I me. am not sure I can trust you, because you avoided fighting these people. Remind yourself that this honor is immense and show respect. I implore you. Of course. Put your fears to rest. We have not come to defile this sacred place. How do we enter? Allow me. I have seen Vinbar make these movements so many times. Thank you. Okay. So was that message that you temporarily joined the party? Taking it all in, you know, before getting distracted by plot. Paint of this fresco is still fresh. It must have been painted recently. It's of a crowned man. Vinbar, no doubt. 
It looks as if he is walking through the skies towards the volcano. A face has been painted on the volcano. The spirit of the mountain. My heart did not betray me. Vinbar has readied himself to join Enon Milfrichtemen. Was that why you came in here? To confirm that supposition? To understand, yes. As the years passed, my Minundanem grew more and more distant to me. I thought at first it was due to his status and the invasion of the Renaikse. But now I see that he was hearing the call of Enon Milfrichtemen. He had no choice but to answer it. Oh, Vinbar, why did you not share this with me? Okay. All right, so round we go. All right, we'll do one more. Yep, that way's blocked. These paintings are older. This looks like it represents a man who transforms himself into some kind of enormous bird. He is a Denegad, becoming a Nadaig Menaemon. Vinba yeah, was also bound to the mountain. It is no doubt the path he has chosen to follow. If I understand correctly, the Donegada metamorph differently according to the place they are bound. Yes. The Sinol Minawi bind them to a specific place, and in return they become the guardians. But how could a guardian of the plains resemble a guardian of the mountains? Do you believe that Vinbar is readying himself to undergo this transformation? I thought it was a very slow process. For some, it takes years. At least this is what is said. For others, it might take place the very moment where the Donegad surrenders to Enol Milfrichtemen. I hope only to have the time to bid him farewell. We'll look in that box next time. I want to thank you all so much for tuning in. And in the meantime, in between time, take care, have fun, and happy trails.